After attempts to find solace at the Supreme Court following a court of appeal ruling that his accumulated wealth was unexplained, Jimmy Mutuku Kiamba's moves hit a dead end today. Through a five-judge bench, Mohamed Ibrahim, Smokin Wanjala, Njokin Dungu, Isaac Lenaola and William Oko, the Supreme Court opined that the former finance officer at the Nairobi County Government did not provide satisfactory evidence to ascertain that his wealth was acquired properly. Following the ruling, the ESCC was given the right to seize over 113.8 million shillings held in various bank accounts belonging to Jimmy Kiamba, his family members and associates. All were ordered to surrender the proceeds to the government. The Supreme Court also gave the ESCC the go-ahead to seize and auction several multi-million shilling properties with a market value estimated to be around 500 million shillings. The properties are located in Runda, Dennis Spritz Road and South Sea, all within Nairobi. Kiamba has the option of choosing to pay the total market value of the properties to the ESCC. The Supreme Court orders affirmed that the Court of Appeals ruling and that of the High Court, which all ruled that the former county official and associates were in possession of unexplained wealth. ESCC spokesperson Eric Ngumbi welcomed the decision, pointing out that their move to fire the case was after investigations established that Kiamba was in possession of wealth that was not commensurating with his non-legitimate sources of income. As such, Kiamba could not reasonably have acquired such wealth other than through corrupt conduct. ESCC says that Kiamba failed to satisfactorily account for disproportion in his wealth when given the opportunity to do so, thus triggering the forfeiture proceedings. This was done between 2009 and 2015. Martin Opio, K24 TV, Nairobi.